It's not an addiction, I swear. Yes, today we have an exciting topic for this video. How my first week learning Blender led me to making my first animation and my first Minecraft render for the Hypixel video. But... Where do I start? The same way most people in the industry seem to do. Watch the Blender 3.0 donut tutorials made by Blender Guru. Link in the description if you want to try it yourself. <laughs> I can't fucking speak. Day 1, 9 a.m., March 22nd. If you've just opened Blender for the first time and then you've tried to do things, maybe trying to see how far you can go without getting help, <laughs> you might have discovered you need help immediately. The first steps are really easy to keep track. Moving, rotating, scaling, and locking the adjustments to each axis. But it was after all this when I glanced over one integral keybind. Lucky, uh, number pad period, which will focus on any selected object. So I struggled with the camera a lot. Moving on, I played around duping blocks and creating a torus the donut shaped one <laughs> the torus like geometry okay um so i'm going i'm going thick this time okay Woke up the nut! Ah, yeah yeah that looks delicious so after shrinking the lard lad donut sign i was taught of the mythical control a which makes it so i won't have to fiddle with the decimals <laughs> send the nut hit tab and make that torus less torical said guru sensei also take the top bit and copy it on itself and make it fix oh trim, it, trim, trim that down please it's too much after adjusting the frosting what the hell did i just do i duped a couple parts to make the frosting very thick and dribbly. And then it came to shaping the nutty dough to my fancy. Entering the sculpting tab. Oh, I spilt my ketchup. I added some imperfect bumps and made the frosting flow a bit more. Here's a time lapse of me creating the lumps. Sick. Control alt numpad zero brings the camera exactly where I want it. Add materials and BAM! F12. The first ever render of the legendary lumpy nut was made with over 4,000 samples because I don't pay attention. For something like a donut, I mean, look, we don't need to go that high. I mean, like 100 or 200 I might use for my final, but that's that's probably it. Switch the cycles. It's not an action, it's a demand. And then started faffing around with lighting and materials and subsurface to make the most appealing looking nut I possibly could alone in the house. Also, in this export, you can see the donut is partially stuck in the ground. I fixed it after and then took a break. Day one. 1.45 p.m. March 22nd. Where did that text come from? Do, do we have the... Did I even record myself putting the text in? I licked the icing off and went to the shading tab to make the duff nut look more rough nut. Get it? Duff nut, rough nut, it's not that funny. I drew some very janky lines on it and here comes the hard part. N no, seriously, these sprinkles were an absolute nightmare to adjust. I get the cylinder on, I randomly generate it all over the icing, I give them random rotations, I make a weight paint over the icing and... Wait, how do I get the sprinkles on the white paint? How do I apply this mapping to tell the nodes where they should or shouldn't place sprinkles? I kept rewinding this back so many times, the words This is exposing a value are the only thing I remember from this tutorial. LOOK AT THIS ABOMINATION! Oh, it works now. Only took like 40 minutes. So I sharpened the Tic Tacs to see Heard if I could still soul. feel and then smoothed the edges. I made some different sprinkles. Here we have the long curvy boy and stub. I made them children and got the random notes to spread them evenly and add fun colors. And then I'm gonna hit control P for parent. So now that that's done, I can select my donut and the icing will move it with it. And I can select my icing and the donut underneath will stay stationary. I forgot this keybind the very next day. Day one, 4.30 p.m. March 22nd. I join a voice call with King and Vex to show my progress. I fucking put it to 4,000 samples, don't worry about it. Why? Why would you do that? Why? What is wrong with you? <laughs> the last thing I did was animate the lumpy nut. I had to also look up how to add sound to the blender scenes. I, wait, I just I realized it's, it yeah, starts gotta... easing in. I gotta do linear as well yeah, you... here. Yo. <laughs> I hate everything. <laughs> it's perfect, what do you mean? <laughs> I tried showing Vex how to apply scale and- uh, What the fuck? Hold, zoom out, what the- Is that the cube? Icing. Icing? Oh. Wait, oh my god, it's in the sprinkles collection. Get out of there. Here's a time lapse of me keyframing the text because the nut is simply rotating and I don't need to adjust it in any other way. Okay, not from the start. Oh my god. One export later. Lumpy oh my god, why does it look like that? Okay, whatever. Oh, Wait, it it's, is. A, it's only two megs? I can actually post it on oh, fucking Discord? Yeah, Yo! <laughs> Yo! What, what the fuck is going on with what that? The two exports later. Here's the final version. Oh. 
It's a masterpiece. Now, after all this learning, it was time for the main event. The Hypixel render. This one went through a couple concepts in my head, but I eventually landed on Noah flipping out of me and TNT tag. Go figure. God dang it! I thought I'm going to your butt! I swear to God! Even if it, even if it to take your weapon, get over here! Get over here! Get over here! <laughs> Day 2. 2.30 a.m. April 1st. Yes, I'm a night owl. Sky recommends me to look at Judo the Survivor's tutorial series because a week prior oh, I struggled following David RB's five-year-old tutorial. Instead of mine ways, Judo used JMC to objects, which took me like an hour to get the textures to work. Anyways, export world, import object, boom. Oh, look at my scene. This is where I do my miniature puppet shows with Minecraft characters. <laughs> One thing that made me mad about David's tutorials was this keybind that allowed him to fly around with WASD like various modules. View navigation block fly. Control shift F. <laughs> Control shift F. Oh my god, I can fly. Adding a background, setting up the sun, looking for TNT in the Minecraft Blender rigs. Why? Why is it called block underscore TNT? It took a thousand years, but I found the actual Steve and Bones in the BPS rig folder. Incredible. And this is where I ping Vex, huh? <laughs> This is a funny man. How do I turn him into Noah Atlantis? <laughs> um, you need uh, the skin and stuff and his rig. Oh, yeah, yeah no, I this is to, where you're sorry, gonna, I need to you're gonna have Noah, to get that off next. I need to make Noah blind. Now, actually, will it will it hurt the textures if I just uh, take this funny old thing called a pencil tool and just... Oh, God. This is bothering me more than anyone else, really. Just... <laughs> Wow, cool. That changed nothing. Please put put your face back on. Whoa, that one worked. <gasps> Yo, he's here. Here's a time lapse of me struggling to move a single thing in the stupid rig everyone uses. God, I hate the BBS rig. Two and a half hours wasted. I went to bed tired, frustrated, and confused. Day three. 12.30 a.m. April 3rd. I, I see yeah. that you have the BPS rig there. Uh, yeah. I'm assuming you don't know how to move the eyes. Control tab. tab. Control shit? tab? Holy shit. Oh, fuck. Yeah. All right, now, all right, select, select, like, the brackets around the eyes. Yeah, now then. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> now then, uh, by the no. <laughs> now then, do you want to know how to pose him? Motherfucker! Python? <laughs> Python? Yeah. Click on the skeleton. Yeah. Move him. <laughs> okay, put him back. Click on his head bone. Control P. Oh, it's a Bone relative. Now then, uh, you see at the top mid section of the screen, where it says global. No, like the top middle. Three top, and a half hours later. Top middle of the screen! <laughs> top middle. Top, that is not oh, the okay, middle! Okay, okay, okay. This. Yeah, change it to local! <laughs> <laughs> there you go! Max, you sound like you sound like one of those Indian scammers when you're not doing what they're telling you to do. Like, ma'am, you need to click on the button! Why is so funny? <laughs> What are you doing? Give me thy fucking mouth. <laughs> 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 okay, no, put it back, put it back, put it back, put it back. Okay, the box oh. to your right. <laughs> oh, that one. Yes, that one. Move it up and down. Bo -bo 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 there you go. <laughs> But these two guys, these guys are fucking idiots, that's why. Move the mouth articulation as you so wish. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> you need to move the mouth. You need to move the mouth, Python. Move the corners of the mouth. Okay, no, how do you move That's, that's cheap! I don't want any fucking teeth. Oh. Disgusting. Wait, what is he? What is he? To do. I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. Click the corner of the mouth. Hit G and move it. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm not like laughs> that. Yes. 
I am no Atlantis. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. I. What? You are moving the camera. <laughs> yeah, I know. What do you this? see versus what she sees? <laughs> Sir, please, sir, please. My stomach can't handle anymore. <laughs> sir, sir, please get get the camera away from your face. <laughs> this is you know, so fucking this set it to the camera. This is the thumbnail. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, is that all the noise? Please tell me you got like <laughs> mine, Mort, and Lucas's like denoising notes. For oh, this. don't worry, I got like fucking four thousand. <laughs> Mort, fair, please help me. What is going on? <laughs> He's doing a <laughs> Why is it so many samples? Why do you need a 4K photo? What do you need 4096 samples? I don't know. Why it was... is it moving so slow? Give it to me. It's moving so slow. It I don't know me. why it's me. moving that fucking slow. It's disgusting. It's it probably because, because, because you have 4096 the samples. There's render. Click render. Oh, the render one. Oh my there, god. There, and set it to 128. 128. I put some color nodes to make Noah red and the TNT wired. Yeah, is the TNT about to explode? Yeah, it's it's yes. I, I want it to uh, also just... Ah, oh god, how am I gonna do fucking Minecraft smoke particle effects? I'm gonna make a... Ooh. I'm gonna check a tutorial. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yes, I need more people to be like this man, actually looking up tutorials instead of how do. At the time, Vex made the best Origins thumbnail full stop. Excuse me for a second, I need to rant. So, another person... Like, another fucking Korean dickhead was like, You know what? I'm gonna make a beat tape of this sampled where it's just this over and over and over again which is basically the edit i did for the one hour loop for lumpy nut so these dickheads were like you know what let's copyright it and that's how i got claimed this goddamn guy you sampling can't that. You can't do that. Hold on. Hold yeah, on. Hold on. they just did this <laughs> back to smoke particles i came across a low poly fire tutorial from blender tutorials needless to say i have all the tutorials i follow linked in the description and they have their resources linked as well add velocity make shapes random delete vertices oh look apply the texture Adjust the texture. Ten minutes later, the plane is transparent and the smoke is randomly adjusted between gray and black. Slap it on the hothead and that doesn't look right. Day 3. 3.30 p.m. April 3rd. The scene was loaded, the characters were rigged, the TNT was primed, and Noah was looking redder than ever. So now it all came down to posing and lighting. In this time lapse, as minutes pass by like seconds, I struggled to move Noah with the smoking TNT, so I gave up parenting and just moved them in the same spot. I pulled up Fate's smog bastard doodle and tried my hardest to flip it, but you can't. Why can you not? Why is that not a feature? Blender, please take notes. So here you can see me adjust the smile, the eyebrows, which I thought they reset, but I guess the I move them back up, and the post to sell that arrogant smug look I was giving Noah in the game. I wanted to give Noah this angered, larger-than-life manifestation to express his anger in the small YouTube thumbnail fashion, and I'm overall very happy with the result. Here you can see me go back and put the eyebrows back down after exporting. I thought it reset, I really did. And that was my experience learning Blender in a bit over a week. This video was planned to come out a few days after the Hypixel video, but I'm a dumb perfectionist and want to make each video stand out from the rest. You can even see it on my own channel. Nothing looks like it really fits together, but they all have their interesting flavors. With a few exceptions. To close this video out, I have the final time lapse of me making the thumbnail for this video, with me taking a bite out of the fabled chocolate and lumpy nut. I had a great time learning the techniques and will be using them in the future. You'll see when that happens. Special thank you to Vex, Destin Sky, and Axiom. They helped me out with these projects and you wouldn't see this video without them, so hats off to them. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you when you see me. Bye bye Certified banger.